Hey, what's up guys? This is Jin from Ori Bags and on this channel, we are all about coming up with product videos and tips to help you carry better. So if you're new to the channel, why not subscribe to us and don't forget to hit that bell button too. And welcome back to part two of the Dango A series video. All right, just a quick recap. So in part one, we covered the main features of the Adept wallet. So we had a demonstration on what fits in the wallet, what the wallet's made of. And on this episode, we are gonna be exploring the A series accessories, right? Everything that you see on this table right now, all the modular pieces that you have been eyeing on. We're gonna cover that right now. Now let's start with the most basic A-series accessories, all right? So the first one is the A10 Adapt Single Pocket Adapter, which is this one right here. Then we have the A10 Adapt Bifold Adapter. The A10 Pen and Notebook. The A10 chassis clip. And I'm also gonna introduce to you guys the pocket clip. All right, so let's kick things off with the A10 chassis clip. Now the A10 chassis clip is basically a stainless steel money clip that attaches to the A10 wallet chassis. So um, like in part one, I mentioned about uh, this hole right here and there's a slot here as well. So this is actually where your chassis clip will be attached. Now when you purchase the clip, it comes in a packaging like this, okay? So inside here, you have a couple of things. First and foremost, you have your chassis clip. This one right here. It comes in a few colors, of course. And it comes with uh, a set of screws. Teeny tiny screws. I can't even get them out right now. Okay, so, so it comes in a set of screws. Really tiny screws. I'm not sure if you can see them. Let me just adjust the focus. Okay, so these are the screws. They are so tiny. Can you see? Okay, that's how tiny they are. All right. <laughs> okay, so these are the screws. We've got uh, two screws right here that's been provided. And you will also get a really slim hex wrench tool. Okay, let me get the focus in. Yeah, so this is the hex wrench tool. Now the chassis clip can be used to hold cash. Uh, it can be used to clip onto a strap or to even attach to a belt, or it can even be used to clip onto a pocket. And it is compatible with all the A-series wallets. All right, so let me speed things up and hook this up for you. All right, and there we have it. So this is quite a sturdy piece right here, especially once you've got the screw in. So it's really quite secure. Now, something to highlight uh, is that when you first try to install it, you might first find it very challenging to uh, install this chassis clip. Now, the first one is you have to make sure that the chassis clip is pushed all the way down and you have to make sure that the holes align. So there's a hole in the wallet and there's a hole in the chassis clip. So you gotta make sure that the hole is completely aligned before you can attach the screw to it, all right? Now the second um, thing is that you might find it a little bit challenging to install the screw, but um, all I can say is do not bother picking up the screw with your fingers and trying to do like a balancing act and trying to sort of like drop the screw with precision point into the hole. That's not going to happen, okay? So don't waste your time. Pro tip for you, get your hex wrench, attach the screw onto the hex wrench so it becomes sort of like a, a little stick that picks up the screw. Let me just give you a closer look, okay? So attach the screw onto the hex wrench like this and it will stay in place. 
then you can go ahead and screw on the chassis clip fairly easily. So let me demonstrate how you would use the chassis clip. Alright, so now that we've seen the chassis clip, let's move on to the next, which is the A10 Adapt Single Pocket Adapter. All right? So now the A10 Single Pocket Adapter allows your A10 wallet to hold an extra four cards and it features a notch just at the bottom here. Let me just give you a better view of this notch. There you go. All right, so this notch right here so that you can easily just push up your cards and you can get your cards fairly easily. Now this material right here is made of premium non-leather detex material that is not only durable but water resistant and super easy to clean as well. Now let me just show you guys at the back of the single pocket you will notice a you will find a polycarbonate sliding plate. Now this sliding plate is not a detachable piece, it's not a separate piece, it is attached to this single pocket adapter. All right, So it fits perfectly on the uh, adapt wallet rail, the vertical rail. So all you need to do is just, you see this arrow pointing down? Okay, there's an arrow pointing down here. So this is the direction of which you would slide down the rail. Okay. Now with the addition of the single pocket adapter, this would mean that you would now be able to carry up to 8 cards in your adapt wallet itself. So 4 cards in the aluminum chassis and 4 cards in the single pocket right here in this section. Now if you're wondering if the single pocket can fit in cash, well technically you can. But I would suggest that you fold your bills into thirds like this. Okay, so I've got some bills here, so just fold it this way, okay? Not into halves, but into thirds, and just you can just easily slot it into the pocket of your wallet, okay? Now, the reason for this type of folding is so that you can pull out your cash fairly easily. So if you do it in halves, for example, let me just demonstrate. If you do it in halves, it might not be as easy because it will go a little bit deeper into your pocket okay so it gets a little bit difficult to pull out now alternatively i would recommend that you store your cash as how i demonstrated to you in part one which is inside the vertical cavity of the wallet so you just slide out the adapter just like this and it reveals your secret compartment okay so when you get your cash be sure you fold it into halves and you can just Slide it into the cavity and yep, you are good to go. Now, if you have a chassis clip, however, you can definitely choose to secure your cash on the chassis clip as well. So here's what your wallet would look like if your Adept wallet comes with a pocket clip, sorry, comes with a single pocket adapter like this and it comes with a chassis clip. So. This is what it'll look like. So if you're looking for this setup, this will be a great setup as well. You've got a single pocket adapter and you've got the chassis clip as well. And now it's time to check out the A10 Adapt Bifold Adapter. All right. Now this is by far the best-selling A-series accessory at Oribags. And I think mainly it's because um, it's practical and it also has that sense of familiarity with a bifold in a wallet. And basically, I think it's practical and it allows you to carry a lot more. 
Now with the addition of the bifold adapter onto your adapt wallet, you can hold up to an extra 9 cards. That's 13 cards in total. So there's there will be 9 in the bifold, so I assume 3, 3 and 3. So there are 3 pockets over here, so one here, one on this side and another pocket on the inside. So that would be about 9 cards in total and you get to also use the uh, aluminum chassis and 4 cards you can definitely use in here. So no wonder our customers love this accessory most. I mean 13 cards is a lot. Now the A10 Bifold offers you a little bit more options when it comes to where to store your cash. So you've got basically three pockets to choose from. So if you're planning to use any of these pockets to store your cash, so it's similar to the single pocket adapter. I would recommend for you to do it uh, to fold your cash into thirds and slot your cash in here. So yeah, so this is where the notch is. And if you're planning to even use it in the slot on the inside, you can totally do that as well. So, yeah, just slotting it in. Okay, so this is where your money would fit. Now, another alternative, if you're trying to be creative, is to slot your cash in this way, especially if you don't enjoy folding your cash. So you can actually put it this way. But I don't think many people would store their cash this way because it is kind of messy with all the bills uh, flapping around. And there's also, let's not forget, the original method which is sliding out the adapter like this and slotting your cash into the vertical cavity as well. So it works the exact same way, sorry, this should be half and a half and slotting into the cavity, alright? So yeah, this would be how it would work. If you own a chassis clip, you can also use that together with your bifold, okay? So I'm just going to take this out and demonstrate to you what this setup will look like with a chassis clip, okay? So this is how it would look like, okay? Now, I must highlight to you that if you choose to use the chassis clip together with your bifold, your wallet will bulge, okay? So it's got this weird bulge thing uh, happening right here. You can really feel the absence of the chassis clip right about here, these two points here. And then right in the middle here where you can feel the chassis clip, yeah, so this part it will be sturdy. And this part over here becomes really soft. But do not despair, I do have another alternative for you. And this is basically the beauty of the A series, there's so many options. Now, if you are planning to get the uh, Adapt Bifold, and you don't like how it looks like or how it feels like with the chassis clip, another alternative or I would recommend using the Dango Pocket Clip. Now this is the Pocket Clip. It's available in two sizes. This is the normal size, the small size, and this is the one in XL. Now for the Adapt Wallet, you're going to need the XL Pocket Clip. But before I demonstrate, let's talk a little bit about the Pocket Clip. Now, the pocket clip has a number of features. Firstly, it's a pocket clip. It can be a belt clip or a strap clip, a cash clip, and even a bottle opener as well. You can even use this as a keychain. Now, the pocket clip XL size fits perfectly with your A series, your D series and T series uh, dangle wallets. And these are all mainly horizontal orientated wallets. Okay, now back to the demo. Alright, so here's how you would use the pocket clip with your adapt by fold. Alright, let me just attach this back to its original, uh, to its original wallet. Okay, so it's super simple. All you need to do is just get your pocket clip, you see this clip thing right here, open up your bifold and just 
carefully clip it onto your bifold and just at the bottom here you got to be sure that it hooks on to your bifold beautifully and there you have it you have an alternative to a cash clip now when you open your bifold here's how you would hold your cash now i would recommend that you fold your cash your bills into half so this is malaysian ringgit right here as an example okay so when you fold into half you can just slot your cash like this clip it like that and you can easily sort of like flip through whatever bills that you are looking for alternatively you can also install your bills flat out and with Malaysian Ringgit it's not really a problem uh, it doesn't stick out of your wallet okay like so and let me just arrange this nicely okay like this and when you close it oh, okay so as you can see I didn't put probably didn't put the cash properly that's why it's kind of sticking out so yeah it's gonna be a lot of um, arranging time arranging the cash properly so yeah, if you look carefully, you might just be able to see some notes sort of like peeking out of the wallet. So I'm not sure whether this is going to be a problem for you or not. But it definitely does sort of like fit in uh, the wallet just, just about nice. Alright, so let's try with some USD. Now USD over here, you want to fold it. It's perfectly fine. Okay, just like this. And if you are planning to... Open your bills flat out. You can definitely... Yeah, so US dollar bills are a little bit longer. So when you close it, some of it is definitely going to stick out. So it's not going to look very nice. Now, although this pocket clip alternative might make your wallet thinner compared to the one with the chassis clip, but it does add about five, uh, 0 0.5 centimeters to your wallet height. Now, personally, I would choose this option for the bifold wallet, the pocket clip option, uh, as I find it neater and less bulky compared to the option with the chassis clip. But then again, it's really your own personal choice. And of course, price-wise, the pocket clip is a lot more expensive uh, compared to the chassis clip given the added features. Now, the chassis clip, right now, the time this video was made, retails at 69 uh, ringgit. The regular, the small pocket clip retails at 139, while the pocket clip XL, this one right here, retails at 179 ringgit. Moving along, besides the pocket clip, did you know that you can also get other accessories to go with your Adapt Bifold? I know, right? Accessory with an accessory. So the Bifold actually comes with a pen slot. If you take a closer look here, you'll see a hole here. This is a pen slot. And there is also a slot here within the wallet which you can use for your cards. And alternatively, if you like, uh, or if it suits your lifestyle, you can also get a mini notebook, a dangle notebook to go with this, all right? So, um, here's how the bifold would look like with the accessory, the pen, and the notebook attached, okay? So this is the dangle mini notebook. This is 48 pages. You can get it from Dango as well. They sell this mini notebook as well. And over here, you have the Dango pen, okay? This pen is made from anodized aluminum, all right? So you just need to pull it out like this, and it twists open. It takes a while, okay? So yeah. If you're wondering how this setup will look like with the chassis clip, let me just show you how it would look like. Okay, so I've got my wallet with the chassis clip. I'm gonna, whoops, I'm gonna attach this. All right, okay, so now this is the setup with the chassis clip. Okay, and this is the normal bifold. So I'm just giving you a size comparison. 
all right now as you can see it's super bulky and i think if you use this setup you will definitely get some serious wallet butt with this but then again who am i to say because this setup may be exactly what you need like you know if you're somebody who needs to take notes along the way you need to carry a pen with you all the time and you find that the chassis clip is super useful for you to um, attach your cash, then this setup will be totally perfect for you. Because again, it's all about mixing and matching and it's really all about what you need. And we are done, peeps. All right, so now you know all the accessories, well, almost all, from the Dango A-Series collection. I know they are probably going to release more accessories soon, like the new colors for the um, RFID plate. So once I get my hands on that, I'll do a video on that as well. And I'll just put up a card here when it's done so that you guys can jump straight into that wow, once you're done with this video. Anyway, I hope this video was useful to you and it helped you decide on which of these accessories is more suitable for your lifestyle. So if you're interested to get your hands on any of the Dango A-Series products, whether it's the Adapt Wallet or any of the adapters over here, Single Pocket, the Bifold, you can get them directly from our website, which is oribags.com, and you'll be able to get all the information that you need, including detailed product info, dimensions, and of course, the latest price. And lastly, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And I'll see you guys the next time. Bye.